Hi guys, welcome back to another video and I just got up at 6 a.m. in the morning and I just went outside to check on my garden and I spot this dragon fruit tree bloom. Isn't it beautiful? So I, I just ran outside and get my camera to make a video about the plant. Isn't it beautiful? It's so beautiful. So, so this plants only bloom in early in the morning and these flowers will die at the end of the day when I finish home and I will do another video when I get home later on today. But these flower are amazing. They're like angel wings, feathers. They're just beautiful. I love them so much. And these one are the new flowers. So you can see these but So we're gonna have another more flowers. My dad is in overseas at the moment and he always tell me to check on the dragon fruit because he loves to see the flower. So these two flowers are from yesterday and that was the one that I made a video about so I had um, we had one flower bloom before and now we have the whole tree is is beautiful I just can't wait to see more of the bird to come out at the moment, I th yeah, we're in February at the moment. So this dragon fruit bloom in early in the year. And the way to um, promote the bloom to grow is to cut back one of your branches here. Oh, so beautiful. And um, we have lost some of the flower because they went yellow. So these are the un unsuccessful flowers. And eventually they will fall off the plant. Like this one we have here. So when the flower dry, you can see the dragon fruit form. But I can't, just, I can't get over these flowers. They're so beautiful and amazing. Um, I really, really want to do a time lapse of the video of the flower, but I don't have the time to do it because I'll be at work today. And hopefully, um, on Saturday tomorrow, some of these flower will. Um, still survive like some of these one I hope tomorrow or so or Sunday they will bloom again so I have a chance to do a time lapse of the whole day to see they're close but yes these flowers are bloom in early in the morning and will die later on the night It's just beautiful. So got some mangoes, 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 and these one are getting ready. It's my succulents down here, my succulent garden down here, and so beautiful. Let me give you a close up. I think we have two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, amazing. And we still have more flowers to bloom. 
they are about to come in. So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up because I am so excited to see these flowers. And um, if you have any question, please let me know in the comment down below. And if you're interested to have this dragon fruit in your garden, please um, get one because their flowers are amazing. And I hope you like this video and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Hi guys, welcome back. And I just got home from work and like I said, the flower has died and here we go. See how different um, from, since this morning, the flower was open and now they all die. And this one is about to open tomorrow. So this one all has died and I don't know what to do. Like this one here, they're turning yellow and I think they're just gonna drop by themselves. So this, yeah, by the touch, yeah, it's really soft. Yeah, so it just, it just fall off. And um, I'm not sure um, some of these one will, will die and how sad. Look at these flowers. They was beautiful this morning and now they just die. But then I have concern about, I am concerned about the rain at the moment. So it's raining, but not very heavy. And my concern is the water getting inside these um, uh, crown of the flower and might rot out the whole fruit because at the moment um, the fruit, this fruit here is form, um, and I think I'm gonna cut that one down because it looks ready. So this one looks ready. Um, so yeah, this I think this flower is gonna open tomorrow, and these two here as well, and this one here. So these one are already die, and I feel really bad that I couldn't do a time-lapse video for you. Oh, look at this beautiful, beautiful flower. I'm not sure if you can, I'm not sure, look inside. Oh, this is really, really heartbreak. And this one is rotted. And these two are rotted as well. So, Oh, look at this one. Well, anyway, uh, I just got home from work and it's Friday and I see if I can do a video of these flowers left and hopefully um, I can capture the, the life of these flowers. They're fascinating, they're really beautiful and and um, it's the time for them to grow in this season. So they, in, in, um, we're in summer at the moment. Spring and summer, I think summer. But yeah, these flowers die. And I've been all day at work thinking about these flowers. It's just like, oh my God, what, what I've been doing. I just love them. This one is getting bigger, as you can see. Ooh, and they're hard. So, mm, I'm not sure. So, oh yeah, oh. This, um, this plant has like a little uh, spike, like a little thorn, like the cactus. And I got caught in, so I just hate them. I hate them so much. Ooh. I just don't want to touch them, but the flowers are amazing. Um, anyway, I'm just gonna show you the update of the life of the flower. So, thanks for watching my video and please subscribe to my channel for more. Um, so I'll see you in the next videos. Bye. Okay, 
one thing I was about to say is the way to tell the flower um, has bloom or they die is they droop like that so you can see they droop like that but then these flower they're pointing up so that means they about to bloom like this one up the top here as well so these two behind has bloom and they finished their bloom so yeah they close down and they droopy and this one down here is maybe bloom tomorrow let me let me help them open get, get this one away from that so it can bloom easy easily and this one here yeah so it's already dead this one died this one is about to bloom and so that's that's one way to tell how um, has the flower die or hasn't died so thanks